No license? Psych calling to restrain Trump missing something huge. A psychiatrist who claimed to have briefed more than a dozen U.S. lawmakers on President Trump's mental state demanding an emergency evaluation and even restraint by force of the president may not even have a license in her home state of Connecticut. As WND reported, Bandy Lee, an assistant professor in forensic psychiatry at the Yale School of Medicine and author of The Dangerous Case of Donald Trump, says she briefed Democrats and one Republican on Trump's mental health status on December 5th and 6th. Lee and Harvard S. Judith Herman and Columbia S. Robert J. Lifton. The three recently released a statement warning that Trump is further unraveling, despite the fact that they've never actually examined the president. Lee even claimed failure to address President Trump's declining mental health state could lead to the extinction of the human species. Since her calls for evaluation and restraint of Trump were made public, Lee has deleted her Twitter account. Users of the site have claimed she has not even a licensed psychiatrist. Lee's physician-slash-surgeon license in Connecticut expired on May 31, 2015, Campus Reform reported. Her reinstatement application has been pending for more than two years. Campus Reform also noted that Lee's controlled substance registration for practitioner license lapsed, expiring in February 2017. When the site questioned Lee about the licenses, she replied, I need only one license. She has yet to elaborate on precisely which license that is, and, according to the state in which he resides, she allegedly has none, reported campus reform. Lee, who previously claimed the three are not diagnosing the president,